Hi friends, welcome to my channel Interesting Engineering. We shall see about the scope of an instrumentation engineer. The variety of job opportunities available for an instrumentation engineer. In our previous video, I have already explained what is meant by instrumentation engineering. It's a branch of engineering which deals with measurement and control of various process variable. It's a branch which involves all other branches of engineering such as ECE, EEE, CSE IT, Mechanical and Chemical Engineering. So, there are lot of job opportunities available for an instrumentation engineer starting from low technical grade to a higher most position in various process and manufacturing industries. So first, what are all the key roles of an instrumentation engineer? He has various roles such as designing, installation, development, maintenance and automation. So, an instrumentation engineering student will be capable of designing a manufacturing setup. Based on the design available, he could also able to install various devices in a manufacturing unit. So, apart from designing and installing, he, he, can, he should have a ability to maintain a processing or manufacturing unit. Apart from these, in his curriculum, he would have come across robotics and automation. So based on that, he, uh, he will have a ability to automate a, a process in an industry. So this is a branch which helps in automation of any process. By automating any process, we can able to reduce the manufacturing cost of uh, cost involved. So, by making use of this instrumentation engineering, we can uh, have a efficient output at a minimal cost. So, let's see about the designation that a instrumentation engineering students will hold. After completing a four-year degree course, he has the ability to hold various designations such as quality control engineer, maintenance engineer, production engineer, control engineer, calibration or testing engineer, documentation engineer and software engineer. So normally this is a field involved in various manufacturing and process industry. So in that a person can hold various sorts of designations and these designation depends upon two main factors such as one is the basic requirement in an uh, industry and the other one is the key skill of the particular uh, student. So when a, uh, the quality control engineer or a control engineer must know how to implement what all uh, the uh, control logics and techniques that can be adopted in that particular situation. And the maintenance or production engineer will be dealing with various sorts of sensors and transducers and also human resources in developing a process. A calibration or testing engineer will be involved in, uh, will be dealing with various sorts of instruments and they have to calibrate, they have to standardize the equipment based on the standards available. A documentation engineer will be holding a, uh, holding a, maintaining a document of entire process, a overall view, uh, overall map of the entire process in the field. These are all some of the core uh, jobs available. And when a person is not interested in entering into his core field, he, uh, he can also enter into a software field. He can also become a software engineer in an IT sector. Uh, since the, uh, in his curriculum, he will come across various programming concepts also. So to hold these designations, what are all the key skills required for an instrumentation engineer? The first main thing is the good communication knowledge. So wherever we go for any interview, they will, uh, the, at the very first session, any student, any candidate will be tested for his communication knowledge. So before completing his entire four-year course, a student must improve or must develop his verbal or written communication. 
Then comes the good technical knowledge. To enter into a core industry, a student must possess uh, a strong basics, a strong knowledge in his uh, core papers. Apart from these, uh, when he has, uh, when he is familiar with uh, programming concepts, he can also enter into either core field or into the IT sector. So, when he wants to enter into a core field, he must uh, he can uh, he must uh, know AutoCAD or PID knowledge so that he can able to design or uh, maintain a document of a uh, process setup and. The PLC is a software available for an instrumentation engineer for controlling the variables from the control room. Control the equipments in the field from the control room. Then comes the computer programming knowledge. If he has a, a very a basic programming uh, concepts, if he is able to uh, program uh, using some sort of programming uh, languages such as C, C++, Java, he can able to sustain in a IT sector also. Let me list out some of the uh, firms where an instrumentation engineer has opportunities. There are various PSUs available where instrumentation engineering plays a major role but to enter into any PSU the major important uh, thing is a uh, gate score, valid gate score. Apart from completing a four year en uh, engineering course, if a person has a valid gate score, he has the ability to enter into PSUs. PSUs is nothing but public sector units. So uh, some of the public sector units available are ISRO, DRDO, TNPL, NTPC, SAIL, ONGC, Railways, FAC, BHL and many more. So these are all the firms uh, which recruit people based on the GATE score and apart from GATE score they also recruit people based on the return test conducted periodically and uh, personal interviews. So the instrumentation engineer has a major role in various sorts of industries such as petrochemical industries, oil and gas industries, refineries, chemical plants, food and processing industries and many more industries such uh, many more industries. Some of the private sector firms where we can have an opportunity are ABB, Texas Instruments, Siemens, GE Renewable Energy, FL Smith and many more. So an instrumentation engineer will have lot of job opportunities available and this is a evergreen field so with no doubt anyone can choose this engineering in their uh, degree course so uh, that's all about this let's see about various uh, subjects uh, various topics in each and every subjects in our uh, forthcoming videos so Keep watching, please subscribe and share. Thanks for watching.